Alright, alright, alright. Good morning, good morning, good morning. How are we all doing? It's a pleasant, well, I wouldn't say it's pleasant for most people. 97 degrees Fahrenheit outside, that's approaching 40 degrees Celsius for anyone who happens to be in Europe. I'm just a bit hot off the heels of uh, getting a little bored with GamesCon. I uh, see Trinker in the chat, you know, as exciting as usual. Uh, one or a few things in there I was looking forward, I might be looking forward to, but. Yeah, just another stream, cutting it off early because, you know, gotta maintain my schedule and all that. We'll be getting into Minecraft as usual. So let's go ahead and switch onto that and get back into our single player world. we last left off we actually managed to get these stairs all the way down the mountain which I'm pretty happy with go down we will just take a quick peek over this uh, railing here jump up we can see that that uh, mountain the stairs go down to the edge of the mountain not sure if I want to keep it that way maybe give it a little bit more variance but you know that sounds like effort that I don't want to put in right. It's Tuesday. Tuesday's not for effort. Tuesday's for casual Minecraft, and we play casually here. We also left off with uh, a new iron farm and a bunch of nice going villagers. Let me take a go through here. You can see we've got. Got our villagers all in a row, offering us some decent trades. We got the golden carrots going. Those will keep us nice and fed for a while. Wondering where our other villager is right now. Did it go downstairs? He has no reason to go downstairs. Got our. Yeah, that's everything's working here. Let's see how much iron we've got so far while it's working out on the stairs. Good amount, good amount. That's some trades right there. There he is. There's our villager. Alright, let's uh you don't need to level up, but you do. So let's get you set up. Leveled up, good. There's a replaceable sword, sharpness two, not bad. Better than nothing. You go in and get you going. Yeah, that's a lot of emeralds. All right, you are fully leveled, but you, on the other hand, hmm. I don't need a bunch of efficiency five books, but I do need to get that paper leveled up. It's gonna be a little obnoxious. Let's get this put away in our my ore chest. Okay. Get these put away. Thinking what I do now, since now that I've got a decent source of glass, uh, is work on the item sorter. The way I kind of want to do this is have these walkways planned out. Oops. 
start planning out this item sorter. Watch my set, there's a cave right beneath me. Hope everyone who's going to be tuning in has had a good morning today. Had a nice breakfast and got some good hot coffee inside of them. Assuming you drink coffee or tea if you're a tea drinker. All is good. All is good. So the iron farm is definitely going to help us a tremendous amount because that means grab a sandwich properly now. Hi, hope you're doing alright. I'm doing great, Trinker. How about you? Glad you could tune in. Uh, the iron farm is going to be very helpful because item sorters require a lot of hoppers. It's an absurd amount of hoppers. Because the sorting method requires two, like three hoppers, and then you gotta have hoppers leading into the chests. Yeah, no, it's just it's just an overall cumbersome experience. Happy dust, welcome to the stream. You had a great cup of coffee today. I did. I had my usual morning cup of Folgers medium roast. I'm not too big on coffee flavors. I just like a general drip brew coffee. I've had I've had some fantastic cups of coffee out there, but I'm not I'm not really too keen on a uh, welcome aboard for the first time. Glad you could tune in. Hope you enjoy your stay. I'm not too keen on uh, really perfecting my cup of coffee. All I care about is that I like the way it tastes. Well, if you ever get the chance to try out some professionally made coffee, I do recommend it. Warms the soul real nice. Appreciate you. Like the vibe. I try to keep things nice and chill here. Uh, right now, uh, the plan is I want to start playing out uh, kind of the area I want to start working on an item sorter. I'm quite disorganized with my items, so having a system where I can just place it and forget it is uh, a real benefit to me. Thank you. What I can do is probably make this here the drop on the platform for fall for going down and coming back up. And this will be like the return elevator right here. So there'll just be holes going down with some water I can use to swim up. I remember this correctly. I need to remember how the shape goes. It's like this weird uh, J shape.
can't remember the sh shape of an iron filter. Let me double check that on YouTube here. Just get it on, on my tablet. Just need to remember the shape of the stone I've got to place. Okay, okay, so we have footprints gonna be. Okay. Is that it? I need to see it from the side. Talk about coffee remind me of something that's probably very out of nowhere, but you have to know. Uh, yeah, I remember Raku. Um, so, so unfortunately, the guy is going through some financial trouble, and. So he's been kind of focusing on more trying to get his foothold in. And then the guy, he got doxxed like some few years ago. And that scared him pretty heckin' hard. So he's been keeping it on the down low since. So that's that's kind of the situation on him. Yeah, he's uh he's been keeping it on the low. I've seen him pop up once or twice on Steam every blue moon to play a game, but uh, I don't bother him. Show me the back of it, Waddles. Yeah. Guys was way too chill of a dude to deserve that sort of thing. I don't I don't know why someone would do that to him. Uh for context, he's a popular uh Gardevoir artist who drew some very wholesome and cute pictures of Pokemon. Got very popular because of that. And that's that's kind of basically it. Okay, so if I got this correct, yeah. Okay, so that's the footprint. Well, for obvious, so part of the, my experience learning how to make item sorters in Minecraft um, was definitely not planning very well ahead. Uh, the footprint of the build. So we are actually going to focus on that before I actually start committing to the parts. So we are go I'm going to just replicate this shape on the side here. So I remember what it is. Uh, Cause one of the first things you need to make is the sort of input system. Uh, which is often a just a, a a way to put items into a chest, and then uh, pump it through a water pipe. Uh, you just dispense it; it goes through water, all that fun stuff. And the way the way the item sort of works is we basically it's a way of tricking, not really tricking, but we tell the hot we fill up a hopper a certain amount. And while it's filled a certain amount, it locks itself, so it won't accept any items into it. And then when the uh, correct item goes into it, it turns itself on and allow and starts allowing items through. So we'll be taking advantage of that of the on-off mechanic of a hopper for how it will sort.
you ever curious about getting into redstone, uh, item sorter is a great method to start learning. That's a creeper. Get out of my home. We'll have to make a bunch of paper because um, it does require what are colloquially referred to as dummy items. Um, so what you do is you fill in the last four slots of a hopper with the dummy items. You you name them uniquely. You give them a you give them a name so they don't stack with any other items. And then on the first slot, you put the item that you wanted to accept. Uh, and then you use a, a comparator to measure how full that hopper is. So when uh, the wanted item starts filling up the hopper, the comparator puts out a stronger signal. And that stronger signal will start will flip the hopper behavior around and start allowing items through. And, then, and so and since the hopper will only drain the, the item in the leftmost slot, your wanted item is what goes through first, and then once it reduces in fullness, the capacitor put outputs a smaller signal, and then it turns itself off and no longer allows items through. So it doesn't drain itself entirely while you're working on it. How do I want to do this? It's a, it's a little, it's a little, uh, yeah, it's, it's taken a bit for me to wrap my head around to. I still have to look up tutorials. Like, th this iron farm here, no idea how to make this. I just watched a tutorial, and I'm probably going to forget the next time I start up a world. <laughs> um... But making stuff like a basic hopper clock and how to make items dispense themselves, I can I can do that. Uh, let's get a chest going. So first thing we kind of want to make is uh, a chest or barrel. It could be either or. I'll stick with chests that uh, empties itself. I don't need a bunch of wood. I do need a dropper or dispenser. Dispenser works. Uh, comparator. Appreciate the follow, Pappy. Comparator and some. Let's just get the general. Just get a bunch of general items. Set it up here. No, no. This. Now oh, this is always difficult for me because <laughs> I want to. I want to put this in like a nice spot. You know, so when people come in and look at this, it's like, wow, he knows what he's doing. <laughs> that there. There. It's gonna work. But Spencer here. Popper, popper. Mm. 
we need to make a sticky piston to make this work. I don't have sticky pistons. Have a good one with it. Have a good one, did it. Uh, have a good one, Pappy. Thank you for tuning in while you could. Oh, be quiet. Do I have slime? I could have sworn. Yes, I do have slime. Let's make a sticky piston. I know Endermen are just just so rude. Set that there. And what we want. Go. That there. There we go. Let's I don't even think I'm doing this correctly. Get rid of that. There, I might need to put my drop spot in a better location. I always get this rock. I have such a hard time actually planning the stuff out. Murder. Yep. Also, I'm very prone to falling. Redstone, boom, boom, heater. So this should make it so at any time that dispenser has something in it, it does nothing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Didn't say I was good at redstone either. Dang it. <laughs> Very dirt. Very dirt. Let's be a repeater. There we go. I feel like there's a better way to do that. I mean, put a delay on it so it actually... There's a better- I know there's a better way to do this. I know there's a more compact way of this. I have to remember how to do that. I used to do this method all the hacking time. Oh, yeah, I, I think I remember it. I'll take that.
that there. No, that goes there. Observer clock. Observer clock. Yeah, there we go. That's how we, that's how you make it more compact. So to put the observer the wrong way. I think. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that, oh wait, no, that, that's gotta go, no, 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 <laughs> I swear I've done this. There we go. Okay, so I do remember how to do that. Cool. Oh, puker. <laughs> yep. Okay. Now to now to make it look fancy schmancy. Okay, that shall be the start of, well, our item sorter. Okay. Means I can keep this here. As our marker for when we want to start get the uh, drop down working. That way we know not to build for too far and waste materials. Do that. Okay. So then, oh, wrong window to tab out of. And then, okay. Okay, so. But then a lot, so we're gonna make this the kind of the start. We're gonna use glass pipes. So we could, you know, watch our watch my items go through. Let's, let's get. I need a better block than cobble, so I actually can see what I'm doing. Let's make the, uh, let's make the platforms, gr uh, the stone granite. Granite. There's my granite. There's my granite. Hmm. 
work. Okay. So the pipe is gonna be along here. Okay. We can definitely put the redstone behind, underneath the platform. Hoppers are gonna be there. That means he, under here is where we shall start. We'll put the redstone circuitry. So hopper. Hoppers go along there. So we go three out. The T shape there. It's got to be empty. That's that is our platform for the red zone that we are going to put. We are out of the area, so I have a nice and easy walkable spot. So if I need to get back in here and fix fix or adjust something, I have an easier time. area up, so hopper, Now we gotta lower that down by one. Okay, there we go. So let's get some dummy hoppers into that. Shall do that. Okay. 
dummy chest. Go. All right, there's the footprint we need. That's good. I think I think for this build, we need to go go big or go home sort of deal. I think we need to make the item sorter 64 chests deep. Which is absolutely absurdly deep. Am I ever going to use that much storage? Probably not. You know, I think it would just look full. It would look cool. Yep, iron. <laughs> totally need that right now. Okay. So then we uh this need to make sure that this platform stays explicitly not destroyed because having that walkway will make it easier so i need two uh, i'm going to need two stacks of chests to make this happen We'll just dig down. Oh, yeah, then I guess from here I can make like a nexus pipe. Sort of uh, whatever I need items that don't come from everywhere, I can just have a pipe here that leads into them. Because it'd be really nice if I can just have this automatically go into my iron chest. Instead of having to manually get all the items out. Let's get rid of the stone. So how many... How much wood is a stack of chests? I can't do math in my head right now. So two, so two pieces of wood for chest. So I'm 64, that means 128. I need four stacks of wood. Hopefully that math in my head works. And we'll be saving four chests. Uh... Two chests just to go down. So let's uh let's go get some wood. So there's my carrots. My hard my hard earned carrots. Redstone items away. Uh, that away. Those can go in the trash. Sign can go in there. Sticks can go in there. They're right. Let's, uh, let's mm. and, uh, you may sleep at night or during lonely thunders. Isn't it dark? getting there. I'll have to start replanting. Or no, it's just it's just snowing. I should probably get a clock. Let's make a clock real quick. As if dwarves would care about the time of day in their mountain. They probably would go on outside. Sticks I've got. 
Just for quick glance. There we go. There, it's midday. Okay. Fine enough by me. Four stacks of wood. Make two stacks of chests. Some casual deforesting today. All I ever wanted to do, to do in life was destroy a delicate ecosystem. You name the uh, game that's from, I will be very impressed. Well, you probably could just Google it and find it. Plant new trees. Yeah, I should probably do that. <laughs> I'm at least coll uh, collecting the sapling, so if I do need a specific wood type, I can get back to it. Dwarves aren't into that elven crap. <laughs> they don't understand the needs of hard work in the mines. The smell of molten iron. I actually used to do a lot of uh, metal shop class in high school. And metal shop smell is just at one of my favorite smells in the world. I feel, I feel very at home whenever I'm in a garage and I can smell welding metal. It's, it's such a pleasant smell to me. Not the oils. Not the oils so much. Um, especially after learning those are per, uh, possible carcinogens. You, you know? Um, but yeah, they, it's, uh, it's, a fun, it's a good smell I like. You know, it probably needs to be updated in Minecraft as more smeltery options. I'm not big on Minecraft modding. 
it I just a lot of them don't feel like it's enhancing the game for me or it feels appropriate. Like you kind of feel, a lot of them feel like they're just trying to make it their own game rather than expanding on the Minecraft's mechanics. But one mod I do absolutely think 100% belongs in the game, like should be an added feature, um, is a small part of Tinkerer's Tools where if you want to get more resources out of your ores, you have to build a smelter. Uh, you have to construct at least this 3x3 three three case of, of blackstone and you need a few like additional I like you need you have to power it with a heat source and it melts the ores into the smelt into the furnace smelter thing. And you have to pour out your blocks of iron or use like a mold to get ingots. And I really like that idea because if you used if you use the smelter, you get more resources out of your iron and gold. And I think that's just such a cool thing, because it's not—it's not this huge, massive, complicated mess you've got to learn. It—it it feels like a natural evolution of going from the single block furnace that smelts all your iron and gold and copper into an actual like blacksmith equipment. And I love—I love that idea very much. I've played I've played modding a few times with friends online, and the only thing I focus on is seeing how if I can get away with making a giant furnace and seeing how much shit I can put into it. Because <laughs> they they have always played with the mods that are um, uh, where you get like uh, alchemy, uh, like equivalent exchange alchemy. So I would just put a bunch of crap into my alchemy table, turn it into emeralds, and then just melt the emeralds in my table. And like, you guys want emeralds? And have them look at it, and they're like, oh my god, Kev, what have you been doing? <laughs> it's, it's very funny to me. But yeah, it, that just feels... Yeah, Minecraft things. It just feels like such a natural thing in the game. It's it's probably the only mod I've seen that I've like, yeah, I'd like to see that in the main game. I do, you know, I've always been, I'm typically usually excited for Minecraft updates. Um, putting aside the, uh, the lack, lackluster ones the last few have been. Um, because because a lot of them always seem to focus like uh, there's always a good chunk of it that focuses on uh, quality of life in the update. You know, and that's that's what I usually look like look forward to in a Minecraft update or like new ways to just manage your resources. Yeah, the stairs are done now. Well. They get to the base of the mountain now. I'm not done uh, decorating them. I still got to make the lava fall go down and uh, light it up proper. Give it some better trim or something like that. Clean up this, I guess. Make the make the parts I had to cut out look a lot nicer. Stuff like that. The stairs part of the stairs are done. Yeah! Alright, looks like my calculations were correct. Two sets of chests. Alright, let's get some more. I'm gonna need some ladders. Let's get back up. My whole uh, I'm gonna need more than that. Don't I have? Mm. All right, let's get uh, one last wood trip. Cause I'm gonna. 
And then I'm gonna need like 60. <laughs> oh my god, this project's gonna be absurd. I'm gonna need 64 hoppers. <laughs> just so they can start filling up the chests. Oh, goodness gracious me. This is just gonna, just an absurd project, just just because I can. <laughs> How dare you? God damn it. <laughs> right. Yeah, this probably would look better with some trees peppering it. I gotta set the lava farm back up so I can actually finish the lava part of it. Might make us might make the other side work with it, don't know. Spooter. Letters. Fifty-nine letters. Uh we'll deal. We'll use some scaffolding. Alright. Now to make an absurdly deep item sorter. <laughs> Say we're doing an iron. Doing pretty well. I like how much irons is making. That's more. That's way much more iron than I actually need. how that's going to work. We're going to set... Actually, we need to set aside two chests because otherwise it's going to be 65 deep. I don't want 65 deep. Just uh, put those there. There we go. Yeah, this is the exciting Minecraft content you tune in for. I'll be fine. I am a professional Minecraft... Well, I can't say I'm a professional Minecraft Twitch streamer, but I'm a, a professional Minecraft. There's probably a cave right beneath me, and I don't know it. My hubris, my arrogance. Wait, I just needed two stacks of chests <laughs> or wood. Oh, well, I got a. I guess I could convert those into the uh, the hoppers. Okay, so for every row, every set of chests I need to start filling up with items will be four stacks of chests or wood of wood that converts into two stacks. Or wait, no. 
No, no, okay, no, my calculations are right. I'm gaslighting myself. You know what would be, be even better than digging straight down to lava? No, what would be better than digging straight down into lava? Creeper falling down. Oh, no. Oh, no, don't, don't put that bad juju on me. I'm starting to question my decisions here. Okay, you know what? 32. It's got to be a 32 chest deep. I um, don't think I want to commit to uh, 64. <laughs> It'll look impressive, but goodness gracious. Do it. Uh, why? Uh, I... The amount of hoppers I gotta make. Do that. Get it again. Alright, halfway down. You may not be a professional Twitch streamer, but a professional Twitch chatter, and, and as such, I must make you do silly and incorrect things. <laughs> it's true. That's true, Got, gotta, gotta please my audience. All the gravel make it easier on me. My kid is old now. Boom, boom. Why are why are All right, all right. Boom Boom's here. We have to we have to see what he wants. Let's take a let's take a look at this clip. So, uh so for context trinker, my mom does streaming. Uh she does cosplay. Uh your trophy week is over now. Don't need that. Oop, wrong button. And I think she's live right now, actually. Is she live, Boom Boom? So this is this is my Madre. This is Yeah, she's looks like she's still live right now. I don't know. We didn't put a sticker of my kid in there. That's my kid, but he is old and hairy now. No, right? I don't know. That's all you came over to share with me, Boom Boom. You gotta try harder, Boom Boom. You gotta try harder than that. <sighs> Is that me? You put a sticker of my, my kid in there. Is that me or is that Alec? I think that's. Is that me? I can't remember. Can't tell. I don't remember what I looked like when I was younger. All right, back back to the mine. Crafts. 
It is me. Do I look smug? Do I just do I just have a I do I just have resting smug face? Later, boom boom. So yeah, uh, my mom's a Twitch streamer. Uh, she got into it a bit earlier than I did, trying to take it seriously, and she does uh, cosplay. Uh, she's competed at TwitchCon, uh, and has and has actually won in the 2019 uh, cosplay contest uh, for her category of larger than life. Must have got got the smug face from my father, probably. So easy guard cosplay. Uh, actually, yeah, I uh, one comic convention I had her go to make a more. I had her. I got her to make me a Gardevoir cosplay of sorts. Uh, it was a suit. It was sort of like a. Uh, what's the word? It had a red tie uh, and kind of white overcoat with a green under, sort of thing. It was before I had my hair grown out the way I do, I currently do now. So I, uh, yeah, I wasn't too happy with the way I looked in it. Uh, plus, I've gotten, I've gotten a little larger around the waist, so it doesn't fit as easily. But yeah, I was pretty, you know, I had fun wearing it while I did. Uh, but the level of cosplay she does, I, uh, well, this is this is contest winning stuff, so. It's it's pretty good costuming and cosplaying. Dirt. Kind of curse the the one you wanted me to make. This is the hole you wanted me to make. This is where all my items are going to get sorted. So two set five times sixty four. That's two three hundred. Means I need 320 ingots of iron to make all the hoppers. Just pull up a calculator on my tablet so I can, because I can't do division like that. Calculator, please. 320 divided, no, not times, divided by 64. I need five stacks of iron. Yeah, no duh, I need five stacks of iron. That should have been an easy. All right, the 64 deep layer of chest. <laughs> Let's put a torch down here. We didn't even make it to deep slate. <laughs> hey hey mtv cribs welcome to my crib uh this is my pit of chests don't ask what it does
Wow, exactly the number of ladders I needed. Incredible. <laughs> oh, goodness. All right, all right, okay. I'm going to fall down that at some point. I just know it. We got five stacks. We're getting close to five stacks, so I think a bit... a trip outside will uh, remedy that. Plant some trees while we're down there. Yeah. Don't even know if any of these will grow, but worth a shot. Duplex chests. <laughs> he didn't know why. He just liked them. His wife wanted climbing roses. He wanted chests. He didn't know why. He just liked chests. You know what reference that is, I'll be well, kind of impressed, I guess. Two stacks of wood, of logs, coming up. But pick titles are important. <laughs> That's true. I really wish it wasn't true, but it is. Dang it. We'll leave the uh, B one alone. Are they even? Yeah, it's full of honey. I don't even know if the bees are alive here. The B one gets to stay. I don't know, most viewed clips across all channels is titled How to Win at X, and it's anything, and it's anything but a guide to success. That's great. It's incredible. Gosh darn it. That's heckin' mountain. This is why I built stairs on you. Do I have mending on my axe? No, I don't have mending on my axe. I need to get mending on my axe. We'll take care of that after this log run. saplings. You know what curse knowledge I learned today? These. Damn, damn it. No. Stop it! 
Go to bed. God. I find it so funny. The community voted for phantoms to be added into the game. Like, overwhelmingly voted for them. <laughs> and they're one of the worst, most hated things in the game. That's why everyone is so, like, apprehensive about the mob vote whenever they- whenever, uh, Moying hosts one. Because they're like, I don't want to get screwed over by the community putting in mobs, I don't- annoying mobs that are useless or do nothing. You know? <laughs> like our players are masochists, can't say I'm surprised. <laughs> I don't even know if it was out of masochism or spite or anything, just, like, everyone thought it was, like, a cool idea. Like, oh, yeah, you don't sleep for a while, and then, you know, they come out, and, you know, they're just, they're just annoying. <laughs> Usually when I, there's been a few times where I'll run, uh, multiplayer servers with my friends, and... Just to make things a little bit nicer on everyone, I put on uh, plugins that disable phantoms. Because it's, you know, it's really hard coordinating a bunch of players to go to sleep, even with um, plugins that make it easier. You know, because there's like, the, there's like, there's really no happy solution to it. Because um, there's like plugins where like, as long as one player goes to bed in Minecraft, it'll cycle the night. And then there's plugins where you need at least half the players on the server to go to bed. You know? So it's it's just really difficult depending on what people want for the day. And so, my, and so phantoms just kind of just aggravate that. So it's just a lot easier if they're just taken out rather than trying to find weird bed solutions. That'll do for now. Let's get some mending real quick on my axe. And then... What else do I need? So I got to touch on. Can't think of anything I need to do right now. Or at least what I can do that's like on the list of things I want to do. Let's see. Get some emeralds, get a book. Uh, you. Mending, yes please. Thank you. Need to hydrate and stretch. Well, at the two hour mark, we do that. I do have a cup of coffee. Not the best way to hydrate, but it keeps the thirst quench. Do we have five stacks of iron? You're, yes, we do. So one, two, three, four, and five. Nice, nice. Iron golem flesh is useful as always. 
I am considering, uh, and maybe when 1.20 drops in the future, that I open up, I start with mul a multiplayer server again with my friends, and I give them permission to gaslight me the entire time. Like, they're allowed to hop on the server whenever they want. I'm only allowed to hop on the server while I stream, and they're just allowed to just fuck with me. Not, like, terribly. Not, like, so much it becomes, like, a, a problem on my end where it makes it difficult for me. But just so much that it causes confusion. <laughs> Alright, 64 offers. That's probably around when 1.20 comes. I don't want to do that sort of thing, um, like, soon, because, you know, it'd be a little, a little rude, uh, just restarting the world after, you know, after all this progress and, pe and a handful of people following along. But I think it would be a very entertaining idea, where every time I log on to my own world, I don't know what my friends have done. Yeah, we're good friends like that, so I would I would trust them with it. No one's no one will be super malicious about it. Cuz I'm the type of uh player who I like to be mischievous, but I don't like to ruin people's fun or hard work. Cuz you know, that's that's crossing a line. You don't you don't want to make it so people feel like they have to protect themselves from you or hide things from you. If that makes sense. It should it shouldn't have to come to that. And so that's kind of where I like to keep things. It does. What do you mean it does? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. As long as I keep it, you know, gentlemen's rules, don't ruin the fun for everyone, then I'm, I'm cool with whatever happens. That's that's for something that's for way later down the road. I like the light in the middle of all this. Oh yeah. Yep. All right. <laughs> I think that's enough for cobblestone. <laughs> Probably is it, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's uh set up the glass tube that we will be 
using as a quote-unquote pipe. We'll just set that there in the meantime. Don't know why I put all these here. Glass, glass. Glass. You know what my favorite drink is? Glass. Thanks. <laughs> So I'm just going to temporarily set this up so I know how far I got to uh, put the water buckets. Leave one more. So we set that there. Okay. Okay. We need to get rid of these because those need to be hoppers instead. Right there. Okay. Glass just makes it look nice. Uh, now let's uh, set up the circuitry. Need some. Do not. Gotta get. Ah, now nah, we'll do it. We'll do it the paper way. We need. We need a comparator. So I'm gonna need to make some redstone torches. Some smooth stone and some quartz. Just make a bunch of comparators in the meantime. And we're going to need more redstone torches. And uh, where's my repeat repeaters? So, barrier goes there, then we set up redstone along like this, then the repeater, Dang it. then the repeater goes along like that. And then the redstone torch goes there. Uh, Alright, let's make some paper and then name it. Got a bunch of sugar cane down at the base that's growing. Harvest some of that. No solicitors. Shortcut.
definitely gonna have to move the bamboo because it's a bit of an eyesore now. <laughs> All I got, that's all I got. All right. Paper, is that enough? Don't think that's enough paper. Or six, oh no, it is. Okay, it's enough for one of these filters. Okay. So then what we need to do is rename the paper. It's on my anvil. Set it up. Filter paper. Then in this one, we do one, two, three, and four. And then on that last slot, we put the item we want to go into it. Get some more cobbles. Just get a bunch of cobble. Come on. Thank you, game. So as you can see, now that this is full enough, this starts draining. And for now, we will put a water bucket here. And then just block it off, because all we're going to be doing is cobble right now. And then cover it up so none of it spills out. Okay. Boom. Now only the cobble goes in there. However, due to an unfortunate oversight, this is a bit too fast for the items. So later down the line, I do need to make it uh, a rigor uh, an endpoint system where um, uh, no, not an endpoint overflow because that uh, that hopper clock design does dispense items a little too fast for the hoppers to keep up with. If we go to the bottom here, we can see our chat our items are reaching the bottom. So that's exactly what I want. show that it works fine. Uh, 
helps if I don't fall down. Uh, we will put glass in there. As you can see, the glass is not getting picked up by the hopper. Because there's no spot for the glass to fill. Easy stuff. Get all my cobble in there. And then so since we got that system working, uh, I do need to start planning out what filter goes where. Uh, so you know we've got, you know we've got the cobble, and then maybe some smooth, some regular stone, smooth stone, and just like granite, you know those sort of things. stuff like gunpowder like stuff like gunpowder in them and coal I don't think we'll be putting coal in there though that's yep um, maybe we'll put coal in there maybe not we'll see when we get there but yeah but we gotta Definitely plan out a bunch more space because adding more track to this will not be fun whatsoever. Because once I get to the end of it, you know, I'm gonna I have to put like the overflow chest, you know, like oh, here's all the items that didn't get filtered because you know it was too much for it. I don't know if I want to make it uh, an infinite loop. I just like have to just keep, just keep um, flowing in circles until it does get sorted or not. Yeah, that's that's the start of it. Maybe I'll just keep it simple and just have it like uh, a single chest double chest at the end of it and then just not worry about over complicating it. Yeah, I guess I can just start sort uh organizing it. The way we can um do this is put the item on top of the glass so I know where to, from the top, I know where to jump down. Sounds like a plan that needs sleeping over. Maybe, yeah, a good, a good sleepover would definitely fix it. Okay. So, we know 
Uh, we got cobble. We'll put smooth stone here. Or regular stone. It's no longer smooth stone. And, uh, now I've got... Yes, there we go. There's the new smooth stone. We'll put you there. This will just be how I or uh, easier way to organize items. Let's get one of each cobble type, so I know. Yeah, you know what? Go big or go home. We will do cobble slabs, cobble stairs. And cobble fences. And then... Chiseled, why not? Make a bunch of stone items. And that'll... I guess that could be, you know, the start of it. Those. Do me. No, my block. Give me. Those blocks are precious. That keep them safe. Okay. So cobble that. Cobble stairs. Cobble slab. And cobble fences. There we go. That's how we'll mark them. And we got room for four more items, so let's do stone, stone stair, stone slab. Oh, wait. We've... No, we got cobble slab. Um, what can we put on this last one? I don't know. We'll figure it out. Look at that go. Sure is going. <laughs> I'll just put all this in here in the meantime. Uh, do some iron trading. Get rid of this stuff too. We can put that in a composter. That'll let out one of these villagers so I can start, uh, so I can breed another villager and get uh, some more librarians, because I desperately need an Unbreaking 3 villager. Yesterday I tried rolling for one, and it just absolutely refused to give me one after an hour and a half of trying to roll it. Gave me seven mendings, though. Let that sink in. That was obnoxious. Need to make an automatic one of these. Ha. 
Yep. It's for you. It's for you. So I gotta actually get my axe repaired. Thank you, thank you. Give me some carrots. All right, lots of carrots. There's the leftovers in there. Anything else I can? Yeah, we'll get the slabs filtered in the future. Those in there. Oh yeah, we'll have to make dirt. We'll have to make a dirt and grass thing. Throughout all the dirts. All right, sorry for being ahead to bed. Have a good night and rest soon. Thank you very much for hanging out, Trinker. Hope you have a good night, good sleep, and all that. Catch you next time. Oh, we can put gravel on that last one. Yeah. Uh, yeah, this last one can just be gravel. Uh, gravel. I know what I need. Need to get a brewing stand. Do not have. Why do I not have enough boat? I need a boat. Bedtime. Lava. Wait, why am I doing it this way? I don't need to travel overseas. I just gotta go through my nether portal. Oh no! There's a baby villager! We do need the boat. I was wondering for what does. Okay. Okay, I do okay, so I need to dig up some nether rack. Come along now. Alright. In the boat. In the boat. No. No! Ugh. 
Okay, good. You're in the boat. Yes, oh god. Okay, let's fix that. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Yes. Oh, the things I do. The <laughs> oh, near death experiences are not fun, not at all. Is still this man's job. Yep, you're unemployed. <laughs>
I shall go there. That looks nice. That looks great. Hello, child. You do not understand what I went through to get you out of there. Okay. Um. Um. Yep. Take care of that. Okay, okay. Put those away. Junk. Wood chest. Alright, let's look up the work on the rest of the lava fall. So we are going to want a bunch of polish. That way I need to use that first. Go. All right. Keep that mind up because I don't want him growing into. I want him to grow into a cleric, so I have like a dump for zombie flesh at least. So what I do know is put that there. I'm gonna need some stairs to put a, uh, put on top of it. We'll take care of that later. What kind of uh, those look like brick stores? Is that right? Am I doing that right? Can't tell. I need one back. That. There we go. Oh. Yeah, mm, bless me.
Nice. All right. Head back up. Well, it does seem I am approaching the... Ooh. I don't have the resources for it. We are approaching the two-hour mark of the stream. And everyone happens to be there and listening. This is usually when I uh, take a quick break to walk around, stretch my legs, get some water, feed myself if I'm a little hungry, you know, that sort of deal. So we will shall be going into break mode.
All right, all right, all right. Break time is over. Got myself a can of Pepsi. Got myself all nice and stretched. Let's get back into the Minecraft. I... Ah, yes, I was working on my stairs, so I do need some more polished. And then I need to set back up a way to farm lava. Are you a cleric? Awesome, you're a cleric. That means I can put this back. Did I hear... Hold on, hold on, did I hear that right? Okay, so there isn't another villager. Okay, never mind on that. Let's put that down. Let's get some more. Uh, we need, uh, no, let's get some polish. I think I've got some brick, it's like brick stairs in my chest. Yeah, there we go. And then... And these, there we go, that's what I need. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Yes. Okay, good, good, good. Got Zambu cleric down there. We will. Now's not the time to be gathering zombies, but soon in the future we will, so I can start. Getting better discounts on those trades. Put that there. And stair. Stairs. Stair, stair, stairs. Stair, stair, and stair. Cool. Alright. That looks nice for a bit, and then we get some iron bars later down the line. We need further down. Let's start taking care of this. Is that where we want it? I can't remember how to make that flow correctly. Okay, so the stairs gotta be above by one. Okay, so get rid of that. There we go. Stairs and stairs. So many stairs. Ah, demons. Demons of the night. The Zombos. They are going to get me. I think. Coming after me, bud?
Be the end of the lava fall right there. Cool. That'll be good stuff. Those back in there. Get rid of that. How you doing, Cleric? That's a lot. Oh, source of redstone. That's all. Yeah, that's great. Definitely a good, good thing to have. Would be an infinite source of redstone. Uh, well, oh yeah. yeah. Me polished. Bunch more polished. Then those carrots. Okay. Ugh, it's gonna be awesome once this is done. All right, all right, let's go. Ooh, right there, yeah. <laughs> oh, it's awesome. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. We gotta put, we gotta put a bucket of lava down from that end and see how it looks. Got a bucket. So uh, we can now remove that with that flow. What are you doing? Don't do it. I swear. 
where you hop into that nether portal. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yes. All right, we gotta put this one here. Don't think did I do that correctly? No, I didn't do that correctly, darn it. <laughs> I didn't do the stairs right. <laughs> ah. No, 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 we're not, we're not, no, 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 no. reach the bottom for yeah I knew I did something wrong gosh darn it No, wait, I did. <sighs> okay. Boy, I'm a, I'm a heckin' goober. It's not, it's not the sides that are wrong, it's the stone. No. Let's go, come on. So that's got to go down by one. Got to get rid of this.
That should be it. Leave. And then this, we gotta uh, take care of this. Yeah, that's even. Am I doing this right? I don't feel like I am. Gonna take out all this. Okay, okay. I don't feel like I did that right. I'm not following the pattern I set down at the beginning. Oh no, 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 that is... Is that... I can't tell with the rain. No, no, that is, that is the pattern I laid down. Okay. Okay, okay, cool. Let's see how it looks. Yeah, ha <laughs> Let's uh, actually craft some iron bars in the meantime. Uh, 
punch there. Let's uh, stack and see how far that gets us. We have an—I mean, we have an infinite. I have an infinite source of iron, but you know, I don't want to make a bunch of iron bars. I won't ever use. Oh, the lantern! The lantern! We need the lantern. There we go. No! <laughs> Damn it! Ugh. Well, good thing I've got a replacement. Turn will go there. Yes, it makes it all the way to the bottom. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh yeah, we've got to put another corner thing here, too. Uh, let's take care of it. Let's get some. Uh, let's get that uh, glow shroom.
Thank you, Sammy. Really like the way it's turning out. There, but there. Three and two. Yo. Need to uh, that on the center there. Cross. Okay. Low shroom goes there, and then stair, stair, stair. There. Nice, nice, nice. And uh, a lantern right there. Yeah. All right. Now what I should probably do in the meantime is set back up a lava farm. So I can actually finish off all the lava. I think there's one feature from Mod I wish they would add as a base game for Minecraft. What would that be? I'm uh, gonna put this lava farm right here. You have six and F10 combo that most modern Minecraft packs have, which give you a visualization of light levels. Hmm. Don't know how. Well, light levels are a little uh, bit more forgiving now in 1.19, or I think they did it in 1.18. I can't remember. Um, monsters will now only spawn at light level zero. Uh, that is a fairly recent change. Which makes it a ton easier to, like, spot areas that are just, uh, way too dark. I think that's actually a lot nicer. It lets people paint with light a little bit more. Also, there is chunk borders. Hold, press F, uh, F3G. We'll show chunk borders. See? You can see where you are in chunk. We go a bit more out into the open. Having to mob proof every single building before 1.8. Yeah, it was. It was a pain. Welcome back to the stream, Kaido. We go out, and then you can see these those uh, red lines that give you a better indicator where those chunks are. But yeah. So, seeing chunk borders has been a feature in it. You can also see uh, entity hitboxes. Stuff like that. You can see the shape of them and their eyesight. Hmm. 
Now they've added a lot of stuff to the F3 menu, so it's worth checking out. Let's uh, get some ladder going. Yeah, base Minecraft doesn't need it a whole lot, but it's still there in case you need it. Let's get some wood so I can make us some ladder. And put the lava there. Alright. Now this part is just a matter of waiting for the lava to fill. Alright. Let's see how we're doing on iron. Get some trades going there. Upgrade the cleric. Nice, nice. Let's empty my inventory before I harvest that. Cobble? I do have cobble. Just... That, do that, do that. And dirt goes in here. Bone well, now goes in there. That goes there. Gosh. So we can start collecting that now because I got a cleric. Blackstone still. Or a deep slit still goes in there. Alright, alright. I have mending. Yeah, that's mending. Get that repaired for a moment. Some good trades going on around here. Give me some of that Emerald dudes. Yeah. Emerald dudes. Go. And then. Where are you, Cleric? I wanna upgrade you. Keep you around. No, for Lapis, that's that's great. Don't gotta go digging for Lapis no more. Emerald for Glowstone? Heck to the yes. I'll be good for Glowstone Lamps, too. Hey, what do you got? Uh, we get some, get some more glue. Do I have emeralds? Yeah, I do. Okay. Cool. Those in there. You two, you guys are still working on. Keep the uh, cleric and librarian around. These guys are free to wander because they have to move around. So, yeah, I uh, it looked interesting. Uh, the uh, new tales from the Borderlands. Um. Uh, looked interesting enough. I don't know if it'll play the same. Might play the same, which is which I'm okay with. Um, because I did I did enjoy Tales from the Borderlands. So, well, it's kind of what they went with three, you know, after they moved away from Handsome Jack. Well, the first one has its own villain, second one has its own villain, third one has its own villain. So... 
So this new villain is TD, or I mean something not vault hunting. Oh, no, they're not going to walk away from that. That's the whole point. Like, the whole reason they're on Pandora to begin with is because they were vault hunters. The only reason people go to Pandora is because there's vault keys there. And while vaults are hidden across the galaxy, Pandora just happens to be the place to go if you want vault hunting. I guess it's time for bed. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. No, 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 no! Get out of my bed. Get, get out. Out of my bed. Out. No, out. Out. My bed. My bed, not yours. Get. Get out. No. No. Yeah, get out of here. My sleepy spot. My sleepy spot. Those are beds for you. <laughs> yep, can play that on stream. I am definitely looking forward to Destroy the Humans too. Get some more. No. Come on. Refresh your trades. Refresh your trades. Ugh. Maybe. I don't know if I want to do co op. Depends on. How easy the mode is to play in co-op, because I remember it being a bit annoying to play in co-op on the PS2 version. Come on, refresh your heckin' trades. Did online. There probably is going to be an online mode to, like, find a partner to play with. There you go. That's the sound I need to hear. Gimme. Gimme. And gimme. Oh, I'm out of iron. <laughs> okay, where are you, cleric? There you are. Yo, that's the stuff we want. Scoots for emeralds. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ender pearls. Nice. Looks like we don't gotta go ender, per ender pearl hunting, boys. And girls. We got girls in there. Get last set of trades. Boom, give me that. What do we got? Bottles O Enchanting. Oh yeah, Killer Clowns from Outer Space, the game, yeah. Woo, let's go! Yeah! Okay, good trades, good trade stuff. That's what I like. No, um... There's a deathmatch mode for uh, a separate deathmatch mode for destroy all humans, and one of the skins you can have is a clown skin. Sword repaired. Cool. 
They actually made a game that was announced today? What? You ki you serious? I'm Googling this. If this is another 4v1... What the heck? What the heck? I tune out a games conference being too boring, and there's fu and there's heckin' killer clowns from outer space. Yes, please, please link me the video. Please link me the video. Let's pause pause that so audio doesn't get in the way. This is another 4v1. Yeah. Oh wait, no, do we play as the clowns the entire way? That would be a cool twist. Wow, in incredible. All right, that's certainly a thing. But yeah, if it's a, if it's another four v one, I'm gonna be very disappointed because I am kind of kind of sick of of these horror franchises being turned into four v ones. It shows gameplay as the clown and clowns on one of the trailers. Yeah, that definitely sounds like a 4v1 sort of thing. Yeah, that's that's definitely a surprise. For her late birth yeah, does she like killer clowns? That's a bit of a cult cult classic. I'd be, I'd be very happy if they just put a unique spin on the formula more than just 4v1 with the this week's horror character. Really just tired of those. Right, so next I'm thinking along here can be a smelter array. She's so into weird games like Lollipop Chainsaw Naughty Bear. Oh yeah, okay, I I can definitely see that. I mean, Lollipop Chainsaw was definitely a good game as well. Bit of an underground game title, but it looked fun. Yeah, along here, I can probably build myself a furnace array. Yeah, that sounds like it. Oh yeah, there is a remake. I uh, don't know if any footage of it exists, but it's happening. Don't know if it's a remake or a remaster, though. I forget I forget which. They're doing good, good, good. good. Okay, source of redstone, lapis, and ender pearls. That's great. That reduces a lot of mining I gotta do. I can see why heckin' villagers are so heckin' powerful. Yeah, that makes sense. That's the that's the big problem with licensing music. You know. 
If you don't get a perpetual license to keep selling it, you don't get to keep it. That's kind of the problem that the Grand Theft Auto games have right now. And why uh, 4, 3, the Vice City, 3, San Andreas, and 4 keep getting updated and all it is is music removal. It's because those licenses expire. It's not uh, not fun to deal with. So I do think I need a sugarcane farm. Because I, I would like to get that librarian leveled up because I'm not going to be getting... A whole lot of uh, uh, efficiency five trades out of them. I had a brain fart. Uh, let's get rid of this. Let's get rid of this. I don't need these right here. I've got plenty of bamboo in my chest right now. Definitely don't need don't need this anymore. This is Earth Radio. Now here's human music. Ah. Human music. I like it. I actually have human music on vinyl. Uh... So back when Rick and Morty seasons one and two were the hot thing, uh, I was watching a lot of it, talking about a lot of it. My parents bought me a bunch of Rick and Morty music on for vinyl. It's a two disc set, and one of the tracks is Human Music. <laughs> that has a screenshot. Oh, let's take a look at that. Yeah, that's definitely you playing as the clown. Doesn't reveal a whole lot as to what it's going to be like, though. Maybe if they make something, if they can make something interesting out of the monster versus human formula, as I keep saying, uh, maybe I'll play it. So I do, let's see here, I need an observer, piston, uh, red, red stones, I guess I don't need that, let's, uh, let's test something. That there, the observer, that, the redstone here, and then I'll just let make it. No, that doesn't make it go off. Okay. Uh, let's. Ooh, 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 ooh. I know, I know, I know. Stretching my brain right now with the redstone. Uh, need to stitch in your block. That. That goes through there. We put that there. Redstone goes on top. And then, uh, did I grab a repeater? I didn't grab a repeater. Need a repeater. That goes there. And then. There we go. That's the schematic. Okay. Let's... Yeah, I saw... I did see that at the time. That definitely looked interesting. Um, uh, though it does... Uh, I do want to hold my breath on that one. Um, because, you know, I've grown cynical of games, so it might not be, uh, a bombastical experience, but if it gets good reviews, I'll check it out. They had a baby. 
They have a baby. Ugh. Ugh, I can't support more children. Even though you guys don't actually eat. Need another, more chests. Oh, ooh. excuse me. Some scooters. So tomorrow is the Sony thing. Oh, Dead Island 2 show off stuff? Neat. Uh, Sony's debt tomorrow is definitely showing off some PlayStation VR. Kind of weird that they showed off a controller and then it has more buttons on it. Like, yeah, that's that's what we were looking for at Gamescom. Sony was controllers. Dirt. Hey, oh, yeah, I guess walk will be fine. Uh, I need a slab. And I guess in the meantime, we can build the sugarcane farm here. Just a temporary thing. There's a Rick and Morty game. Not surprised. So, best goes, and eh, let's move it back by one. Chest goes here, Popper goes there, Slab will go above it, uh, Single Dirt will go there, because that's where we planted the glass, uh, the hecking, uh, sugar cane, and some more glass so it just looks pretty. Don't know if that'll work. I can't bone that sugar cane, so I can't test it. I don't think only seen the first trailer didn't really have much faith. The weapon talking seems to like talk seems I'll get older than the Duke or Wing equip, equipping every five seconds. Is that the Rick and Morty game you're talking about? Alright, we gotta plug this up. It is time to get some cobblestone from our cobblestone sorter. We're storing cobblestone here. Let's get some cobblestone. You're here.
I still had to buy it. But you already would have. So gonna wait for the last day then get it yeah, with the pay in four. I see. Okay. So I want the observer to go. Heck, I didn't think this through. All right, time for YouTube. <laughs> time for the YouTubes. Uh, okay, okay. Okay, so I do. Okay, so I do have the right idea. Okay. So, uh. I need to put that there. I can't jump that high. That goes there. Do I have the right idea? No, 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 I don't. I gotta I gotta adjust this. This guy have it. So let's. Yeah. Okay. Uh, do, 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 do. Put that there. That there. That there. The slab can go here. Yeah, okay, okay. That's looking a lot more coherent. Like that, that, that. Like that. Or. Trigger cane. Okay, all right. Glass, glass. Yeah, yeah, that'll be fine. That there. Server goes here. That goes there. There. There's repeater, okay. It's there. Redstone goes there. Okay, okay, got it. <laughs> I swear I know what I'm doing. No, I gotta do that. No, no, can't have that. Can't have that there. Okay. okay. <laughs> I have an infinite source of glass, don't worry about it. Torch down so we don't get invaded by spookies. Get some more glass. Is there someone down here? Aside from the usual suspects? Okay. What was that? I swear, if you're having babies down there. Glass.
Ah ouais. I know I said I had a limited glass, but I sure would appreciate if I could not misplace them. More glass to trade. Yippee. Yippee. Good enough. Uh, you wake up. Uh, give me glass. Thank you. Sword doesn't have mending yet. That's okay. Boom. Oh, there's a mistake. I can't have that there. There we go. That's the sugar cane farm. And, well, it's a matter of waiting. Guess I can make more, but uh, I don't want to make more. Okay. Those in there. Hole can go in there. What do I want to do? See that? Get those crafted up. And let's take care of all this cobble I got in here. still a pain in the butt, because we gotta get you leveled up, but I do not need that many enchantments. So in the meantime, uh, paper. Paper. It's filter paper, I gotta put that in the redstone. Filter paper go in the redstone chest. Oh boy, so much work to do. I think I should work on this wall here, because I quite frankly do not like the fact that I can see my nether portal through my bedroom. So we're gonna make a wall here. It's not a chest. 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 Please, chest. Give me that chest. That's like right there, please. Thank you. Let's reach the dog. Put these all away. Else, maybe the sea goes in there, that goes in there. Slime can go in there. That goes in there. Good night, dog goes. Good night, gateway. <laughs> and 
Time to decide what to make the walls in this room out of. Well, this, this wall is going to be granite, for sure, because it's going to be a double thick wall. So let's get some granite going. Um, get rid of that. So I do know I want these walls to be granite. We'll have to mine up some more granite soon. Well, I guess I can go mine it up now if I wanted. Oh no, piggy from hell. That save on blocks, so nothing's eh, why not? Just corner those out to save on blocks, and nothing spawns in there. Okay, it's looking decent. Clock, go back on the wall, go. What to make these walls? That's the question. Definitely going for a stone look. Don't want to use die, right? Because I know that's the bird, bird poop block. What do we got going on? Blackstone. Yeah, I can make it out of blackstone. Don't know if that'll be a good idea, but we'll see how it looks. <laughs> Alright, what do we got? That's it. No, that's not gonna look good. <laughs> Black so it's not gonna look good. <laughs> uh, finally, someone else described it as bird crap. <laughs> it used to not look so much like bird bird poo. And now it, it now it just does. It used to have a better texture. They, sh they just shouldn't have touched it. And locks. Do I have to make this out of? Ah, uh, this is a toughie. I guess wood. I could settle for wood. It's got a wood floor in there. Yeah. Yeah, let's just settle for some pine- uh, just a... pine house. Get some pine wood. It 
There's a bunch over there. Keep my shovel out in case I hit the s hit some snow. Oh, oh. Felt that jump. No. Yo. I gotta fix the lighting in here now. Do for now. Let's just do that for now. We'll figure out the lighting solution later. Yeah, that looks that looks nice. Okay, okay, idea, idea. Just to make it look a little bit nicer. Wood stair, please. There we go. Yeah, that looks good. Ooh, I know what I can do to help make it look nice. Need more logs. Saplings. Base. Yes. And then this. go. There, that gives it some texture. And then... There we go. Yeah, yeah! No, I think I like the logs a bit better, so I'm going to be taking those down. Okay, let's so, uh, back to the logs. This up. Oh. 
There we are. Interior designer with, with Gardevoir. Yeah. Definitely like it better with the logs than the strip logs. So we'll just turn that back into wood. That's not going to be well. And I think I'll put a new water source in the center area, like a water fountain sort of deal. So I don't have to keep relocating my water source. this up. Okay. Then... Let's see. We'll make this out of more polished granite. Uh, let me, there we are. Some more of that. Four. Right. Oh, we're gonna need more than four. Four more. Turn one of these. That's a half slab, will be fine. Okay. Another log. go. There we go. Nice little water source. Okay. Let's put more wood away. This can go in the redstone chest. Works great, great spot for it. Back to back to wood aesthetics. It's more. It's a black kitty. I always like the black kitties. Ugh. Darn. I don't have any fish right now to tame it with. 
Let's uh, hit the hay for a moment. Well, the report says rain's coming in. Interesting. Oh, had it there for a moment. Uh, that's good. Hope they're not going through that near the portal. Go. Uh, one more tree should cut it. Go. There we go. No, 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 no. There. That's looking nice. I think I kind of want to raise the ceiling by one. Ooh, ooh, and then, okay, so not entirely make this wood, but we're gonna tr give it tr blackstone trim. So we wanna raise those torches there. Is what do you got? Nothing I want. Black stone. Okay. Yes, that looks. Terrific. Okay, now to figure out what to make the ceiling out of.
that's the that's the conundrum of the century, ain't it? These way. Let's see what kind of kitty it is. Is it in here? Oh, oh, it's a cream. And there's the black kitty. He's a good kitty. Okay. Uh, do do do. Let's put that away. That away. Why do I have? Two sets of sh oh yeah, because I had shears in here. More torches. There, that looks homely. Get that respawn point. Well, that's looking looking better. She looks like I use this place. What are we got in here? Silk touch. Oh. I wonder if it'll let me put lanterns on top of that. No. No. Okay. Uh, hmm. Away, poles. Okay. Uh, what to do next? What to do next? I think. Hmm. Okay, I know there's a lot that I could be doing in terms of, you know, playing the game. Uh, however, it's it's trying to decide on what I want to do. Ah, oh, just looks so nice. I wonder if I've seen this somewhere before and I just subconsciously decided that that looks great. Do roof stuff. Well, I don't really have a roof, it's a mountain. That's kind of fine on its own. If I go up to the top, it just... The roof in the chest room needs some work. You mean the ceiling? I will get to the ceilings eventually.
I mean, more in terms of progression. Right now. I want to progress. Might be time to go. Maybe trying to find some nether scrap. Get my netherite gear up and going. I do need to get this bad boy up to speed. Um, well, I guess for the last bits, I can... Do I have... Yeah, I need... I need a bookcase, buddy. Uh, let's just for the last few bits of the stream... I think tomorrow we can do netherite. Uh, because for now, I desperately want that unbreaking on my heckin' pickaxe. So we are going to do this. Uh, no, not that. We're going to do that. Get rid of that. That should... Yep, there we go. Alright, let's hit the hay. And let's grind for a bit. Come and get it. Come and get it. Maybe the game will be fortunate to us this this time. Cause yesterday would not give me unbreaking three. It kept giving me Unbreaking 2, which is it's fine, but it's not Unbreaking 3. And getting it to Unbreaking 3 would have been a lot more uh, little effort than it's worth. Because the only way to... Uh, when you combine enchantments, the only way to make them grow stronger is you have to use the exact same level of enchantment or higher. So if I settled with Unbreaking 2, I would have to get two Unbreaking 2s. And, you know, it just doesn't work. It's not good. It's not not good for the trade economy. You... There we go! Holy... Crapoli. Oh, the game smiles upon me. Game smiles upon me. Don't care about the price. Thank you, RNG. Holy poop. Now we can get... Uh, now we can... Use an actual better pickaxe. Start using a better pickaxe. There we go. And now we need to get that mending on it. And that'll be our new primary pickaxe. So let's do that. Uh, we... Oh, okay. Well, you guys refreshed your trades, so... Uh, where'd you go? There, there you are. Book, case... Uh, come on, game. Aha! Uh, a bit more iron. Yes! Yes! Let's go. Efficiency 5, on Fortune 3, on Breaking 3, Mending Pickaxe. Now we just need to get a Silk Touch version of it and we will be good. 
to go. We are going to keep this older one in here as a backup. Now we're going to put that actually in my shiny, more special shinies as a backup. Okay. Yes. All right, that is, well, that was a lot quicker than I was imagining. Let's uh, put away some tools. Don't need that. Uh, where's the fishing rod? Probably always just had it and just didn't notice. Alright, um, well, I guess go get some another right. Villagers? No villagers. Good. Good, good. Uh, we shall build the staircase next to here. Just go down. Maybe later down the line, get a um, that one type of villager that can supply me with like wool. Ooh, that's gotta be. Wasn't expecting a hazard so soon. You know, this would be pleasant in the future for some farms I need to make, I'll need to make. So we can collect it nonetheless. It's a lot of there. It's more than just lava, there's a bunch of lava there. Ow. Hmm, not good. Okay, let's uh, hmm. let's cover that up for safety reasons. And we'll just start digging down this way. Which is also a death trap, haha. -ha. see. I guess I do see. Ah, who knows how deep that lava goes. Yeah, this might, 
might end up just being a tomorrow thing. Because if I'm in the middle of a heckin' lava lake, or sitting above one, I should say, uh, it's not prime real estate for netherite, so... Bad spot to dig. Got to find a different place. Ow! Can you stop that? Yes, we can try here. It's probably like right at the lake too, so this is probably a bad spot as well. Oh, hey. A cave. Well, that's actually fortunate. That's actually a good sign. This cave means it carves where do we need where are we at let's see that's the right level why 15 and 20 one. So let's let's get to Y. So that Y twenty one. Let's get to Y seventeen or Y eighteen. Y eighteen seems in between those two. Yeah, this looks like it. Let's uh. Mark it so I know. It's one of the things I don't want to do is keep taking a wrong turn on this and being like, where, 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 I don't know where. Okay, we are Clean that up. Like it never happened. Okay.
down. some blackstone down there in and out a good level where are we at 15 uh, I said it was gonna be at 18 right yeah right here all right this is this is it this is the digging area of course it's more efficient to you know blow up netherite or netherrack Ah! Ah! Ow! Ow! But I don't have adequate access to beds or gunpowder or sand for that matter. So for now, for these last few minutes of the stream, I am just going to futz around and dig indiscriminately. And there's some scrap. Ooh, ooh, nice. One, two, come on, four, four, oh, come on, we need one more. Until we get that one, then we can have another right pick. Yeah. Take that! You get just one more ancient debris, we will be set. That'll be a good calling quits point. Don't know if that's going to help me, to be honest. Uh, so I know that that's where the stairs are.
Aha! All right. All right, we got four. All right, now we can make a netherite pickaxe. Okay, need some, uh, yeah, what am I doing? <laughs> Put that away, need four gold. We gotta smelt these now. So we gotta wait for those. Okay, so we got that. We go do a crafting table and we make our netherite ingot. Now we go over here. Boom. All right, our first netherite item. A whole like, bunch of durability added to it. Whole. Let's see, that would be. That would be seven numbers. More durability on it. Ta-da! Yeah. All right. Put all that in there. Don't don't need all that. Uh, and there as well. Let's get it repaired now. Did I put lava in there? I forget. Yeah, okay. Now I may have to get that uh, repaired a bit later. So it looks like we are at the four hour mark. There we go. All right. All right, I made some good progress today. However, it is the four hour mark, and I do not feel like going on for another for any more time. So I will be ending the stream now. Appreciate everyone for tuning in. Appreciate everyone who was here for for a while and had to leave early. Thank y'all for hanging out and having fun with me. Catch y'all tomorrow.